Hi guys, I'm Rick Crawley with Achilles Heel Tactical and welcome back to this UF Pro series of Carbine Fundamentals. In this episode, we're going to be covering my task focus drills that I like to isolate each fundamental with, as well as cover gear placement on your first line gear. All right guys, this is side two of my target. This is the diagnostic side that really focus, task focuses the orientation of fundamentals. So up here to the left, we have our, what I call a, our matchstick target, where we focus establishing our mechanical offset, utilizing these one inch increment units of measure of grid. Over here, we have our reloads, malfunctions, and transitions target. Here we have our dot torture, one inch dots. Now we have to refine our sight picture to account for our mechanical offset. And without disrupting the sight, while engaging the trigger in the most interrupted manner, break a shot with 100% accountability. Over here we have our command drill. The command drill is not a game of memory. This command drill is an alphanumeric unit of measure, size of target, that you will execute with a par timer on a two beep count. Down here to the right we have our trigger cadence development target. Cadence is a unit of measure of the follow through steps. No excuse of not seeing your sights, it's not used as a tactic. It's used as a unit, a base unit of measure of quantifiable time that I am processing and seeing my sights and executing rounds down range with accountability. Over here to the left, we have our carbine offset to be shot at 25 yards. We have three effective zeros, 25 yard, 36 yards, and 50 yards. For my friends overseas, you can implement this in meters. Down here in the left, we have the man card drill, my performance on demand based standard. The short card as it's prescribed that you'll see done in episode nine. Over on the right hand side, we have the note section. I like to write all the good, the bad, the ugly on this target. I put today's date. Then up here we have our 10 inch circles that I like to focus on recoil management. Focusing on how to mitigate as much recoil impulse as possible while staying within a refined sight picture to stay 100% accountable to that size of target. All right guys, placement for my rifle mag. I situate my rifle mag directly behind my pistol mags. I have my entire first line of aid to my defense right here on my left side, my non-dominant side. So as I reach back in line with my seam, I can immediately grab, rotate, and insert to reload my weapon system. This should not be considered an all-inclusive summary of my curriculum and my training. 